Now that we've gone ahead, patched our lights, and exited the patch, let's go ahead and create some groups. First thing we're going to do is look at our main screen here. Our top view is our fixtures and presets. We have all of our fixtures right here. Our groups window is second. I'm just going to go ahead and select some fixtures using the command line. And so I'll start with these Van Goghs. 31 through 34, enter. We'll turn on highlight, and now we can see we've got those selected. Record, select our first group. Know that it's no problem to change views, to change panes within a window while pressing record. You're, you're not going to re-record over any windows. And now we've got our group. Now we can go ahead, pull up our keyboard, or use a USB keyboard, type a name for our group. and we're good to go. We'll press clear once to deselect the fixtures, clear twice for a full programmer clear, and now go create another group. I like to move a little quicker when I create groups, and so I'm going to take, let's see here, I'm going to take 41 through 48, I'm going to record, then type group 2, enter. Now I've made a second group. Go ahead, clear that guy out. Look at my fixtures. 51 through 56. Boom. Chord group 3, done. Clear that. Then we'll go ahead and find our darts, which I know are 71 through 76, plus 81 through 86, enter. Boom. If you're not blind yet, we'll go ahead and record. Group, I think we were on five. Enter. Head over to our groups tab. No worries there. We've got our groups laid out now. We can give them some quick names. Again, a USB keyboard makes this very quick. Awesome. Now, I see I skipped a group number here, so I'm just going to press move, press the group I want to move, press where I want it to go, and we're good. Now, it's great to go ahead and make groups like this for all your fixtures, but I want to make some more complex groups too, so I'm going to pull in the grouping tools. Selected my darts now. I'll pull up the grouping tab. Say I do every two. Now I've got every other fixture selected. Going to go record that into group 5, enter. Now we can type on our keyboard. We're good to go. Now that we've created some groups, it's time to dive in. The next step that I like to do is create my 2D plan, so let's go ahead. 